Not now. Sorry, I'm late. Sorry, I'm late. Sorry, I'm late. I'm sorry, I'm late. Um, hey! Sorry, I'm late. You know the movie started around two, right? What are you talking about? Netflix doesn't have showtimes. It does in my house. But we can rewind it. No, that's okay. It's whatever. Do you want to know how it went today? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Well... Um, does anyone have a paper bag? Thank you. I present the investigation. Uh, that must have been embarrassing. Oh well, it gets worse. I, I think I stopped speaking English at one point. Cried? Uh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know. It doesn't even matter anyway, right? I mean, I never really had a shot. And besides, let's face it, I'm a terrible writer. Well, you know, there are worse things you could be than terrible. Would you please shut up? And let me tell you, man, it went everywhere. <laughs> yeah. I just got an email from the film board. They want to meet with me again. Really? Yeah, they must have picked my, my film up. Oh, congratulations, <laughs> man! And to celebrate, two root beers. Carlos, those, those are root beers. I know. I got some in my eye. All right, listen. <clears throat> we only chose your script because a freshman accidentally deleted all the other scripts, and the only one we have left is one about a puppet chef, one about a cartoon duck, and whatever it is yours is. Now, <clears throat> let me make something painfully clear to you. The cartoon duck is my favorite. I see great potential for this cartoon duck. We could do a whole cartoon duck franchise. But we need to produce more than two films a semester to keep our funding, and that's where you come in. Okay. I'm prepared to offer you a budget of $200, no more. And since you know next to nothing, I'm gonna pair you with a producer who I kind of trust. She's great. She's worked on six productions for us, two of which went on to gain acclaim from the parents of people who made them. And the others were, to put it nicely, disowned. Now, 
Not if what I said to you makes sense. All right, get out. I can't believe I get to finally make a movie. I mean, sure, it's under less than great circumstances, but still. Behind this door, my future begins. What I meant was, <laughs> behind this door, my future begins. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, he just walked in. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you owe me big time for this one, Jen. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'll, I'll talk to you soon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hi, I'm Scott. Easy there, cowboy. <laughs> Sorry, I'm new to this whole thing. Yeah, it shows. Um, you must be Drew. And the script needs a lot of work. <sighs> so if you can get that done for me by, uh, let's say, tomorrow, that'd be great. Also, I don't want you to worry about crew. I have that all figured out. We have freshmen who are eager to work on just about, um, anything. So that's great for us. So you know what we're doing tomorrow? Um, casting? Oh, good, you can read an email. Yeah, casting. All right, let's get to work. Come in. Hi. I will be auditioning for the role of Stefano. Okay. Okay. Um, show us what you got. Okay, okay. Well, whenever you're ready, can you just start from the line, um, hello, my name is Stefano. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello! My name's Stefano! Stop, stop. Sorry. Uh, hi. My, my name is Stefano. I have a good feeling about this one. Okay, whenever you're ready. Hey, I'm Stefano! Can we fix that in post? No. I'm Stefano. No. No, I can't do another one! Oh my god, pull yourself together! We've been here for an hour. I'm Lee, and I act. Okay. What the hell? our lead. What do you pay? Pay? You know, this is a fantastic opportunity. Um, it's really great for the exposure. Great for the exposure? Yeah. Great for the exposure. Right. <laughs> great for the exposure. All right, Lee, thank you so much. We'll see you on set. Have a great night. Thank you.
right for the exposure. Yeah, it's what we say to uh, people to get them to work for free. It works on all these nobodies. Oh. Okay. So, today is the first day of production, and I can't believe I got to see it. I'm so excited, but, you know, I'm also kind of nervous. If anything goes wrong, it's on me. You know, it's like my dad always hey, said. Buddy. No! Oh. <gasps> Sorry. I'm, I'm a little jumpy. It's, uh... I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Well... You can delegate. Huh. Okay. Uh. Hey, you! Watch that wire! Got it! Ah. Producing. You know, I heard the set would be great for the exposure. Yeah, but the crafty is literally non-existent. Has anyone seen Lee? I've texted him a thousand times, I got nothing. I have arrived. <gasps> Lee, where have you been? You were called two hours ago. I was in New York. N New York? That's 200 miles away! I'm what you would refer to as a method actor. So from here on forth, you shall refer to me as Stefano. What? Oh, okay, okay, Stefano. If you could review your lines with your scene partner, Carlos, that'd be great. Thank you. I am Stefano now. All I do is eat, sleep, Breathe. Fornicate. Stefano. Hi, Lee. Oh, hey, Jess. Shit! All right. Starting now, I am Stefano. All right, going up for a take. The investigation, scene one, I, take zero. There is no take zero. Take one. You gotta move. Action. Who the hell was he? His name was John Doe. He was the pizza man's kid. Poor bastard. Couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. I want answers, damn it! Oh God. We can we can fix that in post. And cut. Ah, oh, Stefano, that was fantastic. Hi, Jen. Yeah, it's definitely going. Yo, Big Papa Scotty boy. That talked about something. So, um, got a little distracted during the last take, you know, just sitting on my donkeys, you know. And, um, yeah, there was no SD card in the camera. I hope that's not a problem or Yeah, something. of course the problem. Are you kidding me? So we got none of that last take? To find nothing. What? As that? That's hard to find an ass. What? I we had to keep it in my sock drawer at home. My rat would chew on it. Otherwise, okay. Ah! Who we'll put that there? Hope we didn't need a battery either. Stefano, are you okay? Screw the method acting. I can't work under these conditions. Exposure isn't worth this. I may never walk again. Yikes. What? What are we supposed to do now? It's, uh, yeah, it went crap. But with some rewrites, we can salvage it. And with the budget that they gave us, it's doable. We, we can do it. We can do it. Okay. 
And like, that's your opinion, and that's fine, but you're wrong. And that's cool, but you're wrong. And as your friend, I just thought I would tell you that you're very, very wrong. Look, all I'm saying is that I had fun with it, and I don't think you should judge me for that. Yeah, yeah, I hear you, but uh, I have to disagree. You're, you're still wrong, so there's that. Hey guys, how's the edit coming along? Define coming along. Well, does it look good? Define good? Oh, come on, guys. You've had the footage for over a month now. We're doing our best here. Yeah, we're working with what we got, And man. what we got is bad. What? We don't got to go that It's bad. It, I don't know what to tell you, sir. It's bad. I, well, so I have to take this. All right. OK. Hello, Drew? Yeah, I'm with the editors now. Why does he sound like that? <sighs> you could be a little nicer to him. You could be a little nicer to him. I am pretty nice to him. Whatever. So, what do you think of Vicky? Vicky. Vicky. Oh, the girl with the brown hair? Yeah, yeah. I her. can't stand her. Why? She knows what she did. <gasps> oh. What did you just do? Nothing. Nothing. Did we back up the footage? Oh, no, 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 no,
Well, I found this beside the body, along with these two clues. Mm. It's a damn shame that someone took his life. Oh, no, wait, there it is. What's in the briefcase? Oh my god! What is it? It's a bloody candlestick! Now's not the time to be British. Oh, my bad. <laughs> no. It's just a candlestick with blood all over it. Yeah, good deduction. Any other leads? Oh, well, there's always that tree over there. What tree? That tree. There's the boy written all over it. The boy? Isn't that the leader of the gang downtown? Yeah. The boy. So, we're gonna go downtown and interrogate these boyhood boys? Are you out of your goddamn mind? Hell no, we're not gonna interrogate those boys. They're scary. Yeah, you're right. For real. Good work today, man. I say we call it a suicide and go get some lunch. Right, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Pizza? Hello? Yeah. Sorry about your son, man. Anyway, how's about a pizza? Someone get the lights, please. Hmm. Hmm. Well, it certainly is a film. That exists. Honestly, that's a compliment. You know, whatever. Maybe we'll get a pity award out of it. An award? Nervous? Always. I get it. I always get nervous around these times. You could have had me fooled. Hmm. Woof! Butterfingers on the toilet. Not comfortable. Moment of truth. You read it. Okay. Dear Mr. Fields, we are happy that you submitted your short film, The Investigation. However, we regret to inform you that it was not accepted into the festival. Hey, um, <laughs> what about the pity award? There's no such thing as a pity award. That's just pity. You want some? No. Well, uh, I guess it could be worse than terrible. Who are you talking to? Oh, uh, j just myself. Um, sometimes I pretend like I'm in a movie and people are watching. It helps me when I'm nervous. You're not Martin Scorsese. Yeah, I know. You didn't listen. You are not Martin Scorsese. Or Tarantino. Or Spielberg or any of those guys. And you don't have to be, because you're you. And don't let anyone else tell you any different. Are you proud of the film that you made? Yeah. So then it doesn't matter if it was good or bad. You know, you made something special. And you have something to show for your time here. And I do have to be honest through the process and all the headaches that came with it. <laughs> I had a really good time, and I really enjoyed working with you, and I couldn't have been more thankful for the experience. So, let's start over, shall we? Tell me some more films you want to make. Well, uh, I, I do have this zombie musical. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I was... Yeah.